In this lesson, we're going to learn how to use the new interactive components from Figma to create a little grid of pixel art like this. Okay, so the first thing we want to do is just add a frame. So you just press F and add a frame. Let's add a stroke to it and let's put it in the center. Let's just make it a light gray. Uh, and now let's do another one. And this one, let's fill it up with that same color. And now let's make the last one, the last frame, and let's, uh, let's go all the way to black. So now we have three frames that are going to represent different states when you are interacting with the pixel grid. So the first one is just default. This one is going to be hover, and this one is going to be when it's active. And now I'm going to select them and turn them into components. So go over here, create multiple components. And now that I have them selected, I want to combine them as variants. So now, the magic happens where I'm going to go to prototype and I want to add interactions between them. So from default, I'm going to say that from here, it goes to the hover state well on hover while hovering. And I'm going to say that it smarts animates maybe uh, 200 milliseconds. It just like animates towards that. And then from here, I'm going to add another one once it's hover that it goes to the active state. And that's going to be on click and also smarts animates. Uh, and then I'm going to add another one that goes back to the default state from the active state. It goes all the way back. Again, on click, change to smart animate. That sounds good. Now, another one that I'm going to add, just, just in case I like hover and click really quickly, I'm just going to say that on click, it goes all the way here, here, here too, okay? On click, it smarts animates all the way here. Okay, so now we have that, and now we can go to our assets and we can put this component here. And let's create a grid with this. Actually, I'm going to select it. I'm going to press Shift A to add an auto layout. This is going to create my row. So six, I think eight pixels. And then let's duplicate that row. And then let's add another auto layout with these rows. And let's select the row and duplicate it. And now we can create our grid. And I think three, six, seven, eight. Okay, now we have our grid. And let's add a title to it. Yeah, pixel art. And now let's uh, center this and let's go and play or prototype. And see, now, whenever I hover any of these pixels, I get that active state and I can start painting. When I click and it starts painting. And also, I can delete the ones that I don't like. I just press them again and it goes back to the default state. So let's create a little ghost. What do you think? 